What's good guys? It's Sleep Ant bringing you another Pokemon Wi-Fi battle. We're going to be hopping into ranked VGC and of course I'm going to be using Oh, well, we're going into Great Ball. I'm going to be using in Great Ball my Trick Room team. Now this Trick Room team is definitely not the same as it was before. I definitely made some changes to it. Alright. I definitely made some changes to this Trick Room team, including this Hatterene that's not a normal Hatterene anymore. It's Gigantamax. Oh my god. <laughs> what is this? Alright. I see I see a dollar. Is that just a dollar? Okay, okay. I definitely see a Okay, this seems like a Trick Room team too. So I'm mad worried. The Doddler definitely gets Trick Room. <laughs> Does he? Oh no, I know one thing. Uh, I'm definitely bringing Torco. I'm probably going to lead Ndidi and Torco. It's, it seems weird, but against this guy's team. Yeah, definitely going to go Ndidi, Torco. Uh, I'll bring Katarine. And uh, do I want Rhyperior? Or, I definitely don't feel like I want Conk. I'll bring Rhyperior. Rhyperior and not yeah, I had it already. Something got me a little uh shook right now. That Butterfree got me shook. I ain't gonna lie. But this seems like the normal follow me uh, trick room strategy. But usually when it's trick room against trick room, I, I, I try not to use trick room. There's really no reason. Please don't leave your Butterfree. All right. All right, I'm definitely following me an eruption here. There's no, no reason not to. Unless he has a spread move. But this dollar is definitely going to go for, like, Trick Room. That's why I say there's no point, because sometimes I can probably go before he does. Like, my Pokemon are just as slow. I want to click Reflect so bad. But I know this, uh, this, uh, Escavalier has, what's that move called? I actually want to click Heat Wave. I'll go eruption. I know this S Cavalier has a what's that mean? Drill run. That's a Torco, my friend. That <laughs> that is a Torco, my friend. But yeah, usually when it's Trick Room versus Trick Room, I don't like to use Trick Room because there's no, there's like no purpose. All right, Frostmoth. Let's see if your, let's see if your Ice Scales are gonna protect you from this. Follow me in eruption right again. Ooh, dy Dynamaxing his Escavalier? Yep. That's not gonna save you from this eruption. <laughs> you need to kill this Torco. But I hope you do it with a spread move, because <laughs> you're not gonna you're not gonna get through Ndidi. Quiver dance. Oh yeah, you're it's it's done. That's a wrap. Oh wait a second, maybe he do. Maybe he do. Let's see. He really lived. Oh, 
He had the Akaberry. He was at plus one special defense. He had ice scales. <laughs> that man was buff. All right, now what? <laughs> now what? And DD actually just 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 got the last hit. Okay, I'm definitely gonna play one more. But first, I want to I want to look at this dollar. I, I got to Please tell me I can look at your team. I want to look at this dollar. Dang man, I really wanted to look at that dollar. I know it had EVO light, probably Trick Room. If it gets, I'm pretty sure it gets Trick Room. I was concerned about the Butterfree. I thought the Butterfree was gonna come in and just do a sleep power. That's probably what he should have done. Yeah, put Torco to sleep. That would have actually been an issue to me. Then again, I probably would have just followed Mead and Eruption. But if he had a Sash, uh, well, we'll never know. Mm, this team's kind of slow too, but I doubt they're slower than Torco. Or Hatterene. I actually do want to try. Mm, yeah, I actually do want to go NDD and Hatterene just to uh, show Hatterene off. Yeah. Torco seems crazy in this fight, too. Conkel is. Ah, dang. I wanted to bring right here, but Conkel is good in this fight, too. Also, Marnie's battle theme is the best song in this game. Copper Raja and Runerigus. Mm. Part of me is actually tempted to believe he, him to go for uh, Trick Room. I don't want to go. I don't want to go for Trick Room myself if he goes for it though. That's the thing. His team can definitely be a trick room team. His team absolutely can. Ah, should I go for the trick room or not? Does Runa Regis even get trick room? You know, we're going to find out. I really feel like he's going to click trick room. Please don't click trick room. Oh, I feel like he's going to... He did. Ugh. Of course he did. That's exactly why I didn't want to do, want that to happen. I wanted to click reflect so bad. All right, I'm just gonna go straight for it. Since he has a trick room team too at this point. I wanted to, I, I, uh, I knew he had it too. I wanted to just not click trick room so bad. That's really annoying. Cause I knew he had it. That's the worst part. Is I knew he had it. Oh. 
Or I could go conk. Nah, I like Torpo. Uh, eruption is way too risky. I'm just gonna go heat wave. Max guard. So I know they're gonna be hungry to wipe Hatterene out. I've been seeing a lot of, uh, no, not a lot, but quite a few of these Gigantamax, not Gigantamax, Dynamax Persolves. <sighs> well, that's it. If only I didn't click Trick Room. If I should have, I should have went with my gut. I swear I should have went with my gut there. I wanted to click reflect. I wanted to click reflect. Trick room, not trick room, reflect and just attack with Hatterene. I really wish I clicked that. Cause that's, that's, that's so what I wanted to do. But part of, I oh, I, next time I'm gonna know. You know what? I'm gonna play one more. I wanna play one more rank battle. Three. There's gonna be three in this one. Can I find not another Trick Room team? But they're so common. It's get, it's get, it feels just. It feels just. Not even special anymore, because Trick Room wasn't as common as it was now. Well, it certainly does not feel like it was. Ooh, a Venusaur! Very respectable. But it looks like he's in a rain team. Normally, normally... I was considering using a Venusaur, but in a Sun Team, four field sleep power that don't look don't sound bad. Shell Smash Blastoise probably, Scar Dracovish probably. But this Blastoise could potent they could potentially lead Pelipper Blastoise and just go um, Water Spout. That would be so awful. That would be really really bad. I definitely want to, but what if he doesn't? And then he has the Pikachu, and I know what that Pikachu does. That Pikachu does crazy stuff, but uh, I don't think they're bringing it. If I was them, I'd bring uh, Pelipper and Blastoise. Torco and... I'm definitely not picking Rhyperia. If he leaves Pelipper Blastoise, I'm gonna assume he's gonna do the, uh... He's gonna do, um... Pelipper Drizzle and Blastoise, um... Water Spout. Pelipper and Dracovish. Uh, Tailwind, um, Fishes Ran. Fishes Ran actually loses hard to, uh, not Fishes, yeah, Fishes Ran actually loses hard to, uh, to follow me because it doesn't even get the you moves first, even if I am slower because follow me has priority. In this situation, they'd probably go Tailwind and then 
vicious ran, but I don't I don't think they'll go tail one. What needs to really happen here is for this Pelipper, I don't know how, to outspeed the Dracovish and wipe out Ndidi in one hit. With Hydro Pump, it's definitely possible. Well, I think it's possible. We'll see, we'll see. Because you definitely don't want to use Tailwind. Like, you know I'm a Trick Room team. Okay, I'm obviously going to eat this because I ate the berry. Hurricane. That confusion was definitely not necessary. Alright, I want to set up a Reflect Hill. Yeah, I said, if I can, I mean, I am a... G-Max Knight, yeah. I am confused, so... I love Gigantamax Hatterene's crash so much. I love that cry. G Max Might, which will no doubt wipe out the Dracovish. And instead of getting rid of my Psychic Terrain, it's just going to confuse Pelipper. G Max Find is actually broken. A lot of these G Max moves are. Nice, I get off my reflect at least. Scald. Okay, that's that's actually pretty good. Cause now I can get rid of this rain. <laughs> now I could get rid of this rain. Tor tank. Oh, Blastoise. You should have let with this thing first. And now your rain is gone. This Pelipper is confused, so I'm not really sure how... Plus, most of his uh, Pokemon are water types. Water, 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 drag this down. Yeah. I might as well go for Solar Beam. On the Blastoise. I could G-Max fight the Pelipper. To confuse the Blastoise in case he protects... But, eh. I don't really see... I don't really see an issue with either avenue unless he clicks protect. Oh, he's Dynamax. Blastoise? That'll definitely protect him from the Dianta Solar Beam. Yeah, there's no way this is gonna wipe out wipe him out now. Yeah, it would have if he didn't Dynamax. G Max Knight on the Pelipper, which confuses the Blastoise. Pelipper's on a sash. Alright, so both of his Pokemon are, he has to get kinda lucky here, because Oh, he snapped out of his confusion, bro? That's not gonna do anything in the sign. Yo, where's my confusion? I don't know if Steel Spike was the right move. Because, uh... You probably could have did Max Geyser and got your rain up. <laughs> that probably would have been a better move. Alright, Solar Beam definitely wipes out the Tor Tank now. It does. Uh, yeah, Solar Beam definitely wipes out the Tor Tank. And I can just Max Mind Storm. I could double attack the Tortain. 
Nah, there's no reason to. Solo Beam ain't like a rush, and I don't get weaker just because my HP gets lower. See, that was. You should have hit that earlier. So you can bring your rain back out here. You definitely should have done that earlier, or or used Max Geyser. Did something to get your rain back up. Like this is this is that situation where whoever controls the weather is in a big advantage. That really kill. I feel like that shouldn't have killed in one hit, but it is a hattering. All right, yeah, that's it. I'm pretty sure Pelipper is his last. Yeah, I feel like maybe he should have used Max Geyser to get his uh, reign up. I mean, it's a little too late for that. Well, wait, how many turns of trickling do I have? He can't turn this. Nah, I know he can't. Yeah, I can just switch out to, uh, Chikonk Elder. And Psychic Pelipper. If he, if he wipes out Hatterene, that's fine, because I could just... Oh, he gave up. I could just mock Punch Pelipper, even if Psychic Terrain is out, because Pelipper is flying typing, not on the ground. Not bad, though. Three, three battles. I, I just felt like playing three. I just felt like playing three. I can't even see your team. Why can't I? <sighs> Whatever. I can't see these guys' team. Well, thanks for watching, guys. If you did enjoy this, hit that sub button, that like button, all that good stuff. I'll see you next time.